Hey Subbies, how are you doing? Today I've been to Leeds. Today is the 3rd, 2nd? It's the 2nd of May today and it is a Wednesday and I went to Leeds today with my grandma. We actually got the 152 train into Leeds and the 402 train back. So we was in there for about maybe 152, 252, 352. We was in there for 2 hours. Yeah, 2 hours. I don't know how many altogether, but like two, approximately two hours. We went to um, Debenhams. We went, no, went to Poundland, Debenhams, because my grandma went and picked something up. Um, Poundland, Debenhams. Then we looked at Kitty Cafe, which is on my Instagram, which is actually my diff, the wrong Instagram. But I'll tell you anyway, my, no. I'm going to tell you my Girls Love Halls Instagram is official under dash Girls Love Halls X. It is going to be in the description below and up here. And I went to, we didn't go into Kitty Cafe because you do have to book online because it is obviously health and safety for the cats. You are maintaining the shop so you have to book it online because you just can't walk in. I wish you could. Um, there is some other reasons why you have to book it online. Because um, it is obviously, you get all the rules of you can't pick up the cats and etc. So for the first time that it's opened, I actually went and saw it. There were cats in the window and I'm like, I just wanted to go in and hug them all then. Um, then we went to Trinity Leeds. So that is where I've been today and I shall start now get on with the haul without chatting too much away about Kitty Cafe. So as I was saying, the first place I went was Poundland and I used my Pot Marion bag because it's quite a big bag and it's got a very long handle which is a pain sometimes but it's an over the shoulder handle and it, it's done quite a good job. We also went to Boots, I forgot to say, I got a meal, no I didn't get a meal deal. I bought three sandwiches. You might be wondering why I bought three. These are all for the fourth for me by the way. I bought one for today for my lunch in Leeds because I didn't end lunch when I went and went on the 152 train so I was absolutely starving. Um, then I bought one for one for after work tomorrow and after work on Friday. So that's why I bought three, just so I've got something to come home, open the fridge door, get it out, grab my crisps and my drink and just sit down and it's an easy meal. So obviously it was £3 and I have now got £4.12 on my card, which I'm quite chuffed about. Uh, Poundland. It says in here I spent £16. My grandma gave me £6 back because she actually did buy six things. Well, it's more than six things, but there's quite a few things on offer. So I spent a tenner. There was only three things in here. I also bought, I'm just going to say now, I bought Sky a pack, a pack of pedigree beef jum bones. There were two packs for a pound and like the small tidy ones. Then I also bought, um, which are actually in here, I'll show that in a minute. I also bought Winnie the Pooh book for Lucy, which was retailed at 5 99 on the back. It's called All About Piglet and she was quite chuffed with that when I gave it to her. But she'll be more chuffed with things I'm going to give to after doing this video. Um, I also bought some sleepy bath, um, bubble bath. My mum loves sleepy bath stuff because it's lavender and just helps with falling asleep. And that, oh, I also bought Lucy, Sky, Lucy. I also bought Sky a Tucker toy, um, which she's taken to it as well. So at Poundland, I bought two boxes of these. These are the brunch. Just make sure on the date, yes, yeah. These are the brunch bars. We at Cadbury, I'm, I'm not going to bother saying that. Why? These are the brunch bars, my brother loves them. I gave them a pack to my brother, I know they're not a big thing, but my family appreciates anything, so my brother appreciates these very much. Just a snack of school. But these are brunch bars, these are just going to be good when I go out to West Side or when I'm just peckish when I'm out, so they're quite ideal. The chocolate ones, obviously, I will not get any other ones than chocolate because I don't like any other ones. There's guys dog toy tag. Sorry, just heard my bike. <laughs> this was back in stock at Poundland, and this is a big 500 mil. Is it? Where is it? Oh, it's a 500 mil of Radox. Um, feel refreshed with eucalyptus and citrus oil shower gel. Um, I do use the Imperial Leather one. Is what I use normally. That's from Pound World, but they don't have the Radox 500ml at Pound World in the Poundland. So I decided to get some to stock up. I know I keep sucking up on shower gel, but 
it's fine in the end because you wash yourself down with it, you recycle this afterwards, it's all fine. So I prefer getting a shower gel, it's just so much easier to put on my scrubber, scrubber, and just scrub away. Well, not really scrub away, just to clean myself down. And it's just so much easier to get shower gel because I prefer shower gel. It leaves me smelling nice and it's a really nice scent. So, they're the reasons why. And they also had these, oh, that's what I didn't say, I thought I didn't say that. Um, I also got my mum some shrimps and bananas, these are by Bassett, Barrett's, and also some fruit mushrooms. They are coconut covered fruit mushrooms. I also bought myself a packet of trolley mix, and these are the giant value, and there is 230 grams of these. I checked the dates in the store, these are January 2019. I haven't had dolly mixtures in ages. I only love the chocolate blocks and the gems. I love all of them, but these can do as well for when I'm going on holiday. So I could put these in my holiday drawer for my um, the trip on holiday. And even like when we go on trips, um, to when we go to Wales, we can use these, have these in the car and just be really nice thing for the car. So they're the f I know you didn't see everything, but I was too excited and gave everything away. I also went to Krispy Kreme because I was craving their donuts after having two from Morrison's the other day and I bought a free pack so I bought two for me and for my grandma my grandma did pay me back um, which I wasn't too bothered about but she said she was paying me back so I got two um, I bought two chocolate sprinkles ones because they're just my they're just my craving when I went I was like oh my gosh and I came home but ate them both from go so that, I just love the Krispy Kreme donuts. It is so gorgeous. Then, I went to Primark. So, Primark, actually, this jumper was in stock. And I was there like, oh my gosh, I'm kind of twinning the um, the shelf. Because I've got the Payday Princess jumper on. For once, because my Jack Wills one is in the wash now. Which I really, really do not want to wash. I know it needs a wash. And it's in the it's in my basket waiting to be washed, but it's like really it's like sixty five quid and it is wearing away now and I just didn't like put it in the wash because I don't like it coming out not right like my baby jumper that came out bright pink, yeah that's, that's just way back in the past, but yeah paid a princess jumper today so um went to Primark I didn't buy too much I bought three things but the thing is is. It did come up to 11.50, but they only bought three things. One of them was on sale, so I'll leave that to the end. But I bought myself some socks, so I need some more socks. The 2.50 in the neon, they are really neon socks. Like, look how neon they are. So it comes with pineapple ones, blue, turquoise, with a blue, blue, polka dot, yellow, pink and blue. And then another pair of blue and a cactus pair. They were two fifty, and I just need some more socks. They're very neon. They're very neon. Oh my gosh. Then I don't know. Which, I'll just go to next. This is a big thing about you ready? Oh my gosh. My mum and brother are so jealous right now. So I have been wanting one of these for a while. Oh my gosh. Everyone just realised. Oh my gosh, I got right back. I'm so pleased about this now. This is a Bambi hooded throw. I only bought this because of sale. If it was full price, I would not have bought this. This is on sale, okay? And it has the Bambi hood. I wish the Minnie Mouse was on sale. I really wanted the Minnie Mouse one. But obviously the Minnie Mouse was a bit bigger than Bambi, so this one's obviously on sale before the Minnie Mouse one. But this is a hooded throw. This was what I thought ten pounds to seven. I've just looked at it in more detail. It's seven. It's sixteen pound to seven. I got this so I can just sit in bed and have this. Like just. Yeah, I love my throws at the moment. I've got this pink throw in my bed. This one obviously will not be as big as this one, as this one is a hooded throw. So I could just sit in bed with this on. Um, but yeah, it's £16 to seven. I cannot believe that. It's got Bambi on the actual throw and big bees. And it's got a really, really cute hood. I love it. It's got the ears. It's so cute. 
Oops, yeah. I got a hooded throw. And then the last thing I bought was a new bag. I saw this at the till and I couldn't resist. I really, really, really like Minnie Mouse, Mickey Mouse, the Disney Minnie Mickey bags. And this one was £2 and just so that when I go to the shop, like if I just go down to look, like west side to go to Asda for something or if I'm taking something back this bag is just going to be so easy this is a fold away bag and I'm now going to take it out and show you what it looks like and it even has it attached so that you don't lose the actual bag you see the woman in front of me is like oh what in there is this bag like look how weird it is but this oh my god it's humongous it's like a peachy colour a peachy orange zigzag fold away bag with mini mickey on it and it's just so blooming cute it is quite a big size and it isn't it isn't like the plastic bag bag this is more like a i don't know what you call this material but this is adorable and it's not i don't know if it'll focus there you go that's what it looks like it's a blooming hefty bag it would carry something super big like it, it would carry this throw if i put the throw in you'll see how big it is There we go. That's how big this bag is. So this bag is going to probably definitely do a go to our station. <laughs> it carries the throw, guys. That's how big this bag is. It's just going to be so... I just love this bag. This was £2 and just such an easy bag to mess... Like, not mess with, but to saw away. And I love it. And I'm super chuffed that I got it. And yes, I know it's a new bag. But I can resist. Like, I'm thinking about um, some of the bags I've got now. Um, like, the Disney bags from the pound shop. I'm going to probably transfer them into pillows. Um, or whatever. Because I have that many bags. But it's better than me buying the cheap 5p bags from the shops. And the 10p bags. And then shoving them in the bin. Because that's what happens, unfortunately. Um, so I'm looking at the camera just trying to fold this away. That it's actually got, like, the fold lines. So I prefer getting reusable bags, they're just so much better for, for the environment and they're so much cheaper in the end, you are paying two quid for a bag. How many bags can you get two quid for five pay ones? People have different opinions on this but I generally love this bag and I prefer these ones last a lot longer, they'll last forever because obviously they'll rip eventually and whatever but this bag's also going to be ideal for when I go away on to Wales. Because it will fold away and it will go into my purse. And then my purse, that's American. It'll go into my um, handbag, into my backpack. And it's just so small. And it's just so easy to store away. It's just going to be so... This definitely is coming with me on holiday now. Because it's such a big bag in such a small um, pouch. It's just like, tired is this? But yeah, fold away bag. Um, true. I would say super chuffed with it then. Super chuffed with it, that was two quid. So that was all I got from Leeds today. I didn't buy anything else like tops. They did have new Disney tops out, like a really cute red peachy orange one. Wait, but red peachy orange. Yeah, that kind of colour with Minnie Mouse in it. I really did want it, but it's like I have that many tops in my wardrobe. I've maybe about maybe 10 to 20 tops in my wardrobe, no joke. Maybe a little bit less than that, but I keep putting stuff to charity because I just don't wear it anymore so I was like no don't buy any tops till when you go on holiday in summer um so I was like I'm just gonna leave it I'm gonna leave the tops today they will have new ones out I know but and I know it's trendy getting nice new tops but I've got tops in there that I haven't used yet yet well I've used the majority of them but like, the ones I bought last year like the crop tops and the ones that are really nice the ones I sell the, the one with um the flap here for your chest the very open skin one, I had to put that to charity because I'm not going to wear it. So that's why I'm not buying tops today. I feel about quite good for the tops because obviously the £4 a top for the Disney ones. And I was like, I've already got loads of tops in my wardrobe at Disney, so I'm not going to bother today. So yes, I'm super chuffed with the, the um, treading my words out, Rachel. Super chuffed with my purchase today and I am super happy with my YouTube channel, how it's going. That was all today guys, remember to like this video, subscribe and comment down below and see you all on
Tuesday with my new video. I love you guys. Believe yourself, smile. Believe yourself and smile, and I'll see you all on Tuesday. Bye.